Speaking of Ben Carson, Ben Carson, I think, every day proves um, what I suggested some time ago, which is that um, that old saying, it's not brain surgery, I think we've all misinterpreted what that meant. As a kid, uh, I always understood that um, phrase to mean it's not brain surgery. In other words, uh, you don't have to be uh, very bright to do this. And the implication is to do brain surgery, you need to be some type of like brain surgeon or rocket scientist. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, folks, I don't have the education that Ben Carson has. I don't have the net worth that Ben Carson has. I haven't had the success in my chosen profession that Ben Carson has in his. But I know what the debt limit is, and I'm not running for president. Ben Carson, on the other hand, is exactly the opposite. He's running for president, and he doesn't know what the debt limit is. And here is Marketplace host Kai Rizdahl trying to process the idea that this guy is running for president and is, I think, number two in the polls and doesn't know what the debt limit actually is. All right, so let's talk about debt then and the budget. As you know, Treasury Secretary Liu has come out uh, in the last couple of days and said, we're going to run out of money. We're going to run out of borrowing authority on the 5th of November. Should the Congress then and the president not raise the debt limit? Should we default on our debt? Let me put it this way. If, <laughs> if I were the president, I would not sign an increase budget absolutely would not do it. They would have to find a place to so cut. To be, to be clear, it's increasing the debt limit, not the budget. But, but I want to make sure I understand you. You'd let the United States default rather than raise the debt limit. No, I would provide kind of leadership that says, get on the stick, guys, and stop messing around uh, and, and, and cut where you need to cut because we're not raising any spending limits, period. I'm going to try one more time, sir. This is debt that's already obligated. Would you not favor increasing the debt limit to pay the debts already incurred? What I'm saying is what we have to do is restructure the way that we create debt. I mean, if we continue along this, where does it stop? It never stops. You're always going to ask the same question every year. And we're just going to keep going down that pathway. That's one of the things I think that the people are tired of. I'm really trying not to be circular here, Dr. Carson. But if you're not going to raise the debt limit and you're not going to give specifics on what you're going to cut, then how are we going to know what you would do as president of the United States? Okay, let me try to explain it in a, in a different way. <laughs> if, in fact, we have a number of different areas that are contributing to the increasing expenditures and the continued expenditures that are putting us further and further into the hole. You're familiar, I'm sure, with All the All right, concept end this. Consistent. Okay, yeah. look, he does not understand what the debt limit is. I will give you the basic course on what the debt limit is. And this is, if Ben, if you're listening... I don't know why anybody on your campaign didn't describe, explain this to you because it's really rudimentary. We have a budget. The budget is approved. Sometime around now, in fact, at the, uh, the beginning of the fiscal year, a week ago. Then, over time, we've got to approve money or borrowing, essentially, allow the Treasury to pay the bills that we have. That's the debt limit. Theoretically, you could increase the budget and not have to actually take on more debt if we were running a surplus. The debt limit is a very specific and, frankly, to people who are involved in even the slightest bit of policy making or policy watching or politics, the debt limit, increasing it or essentially defaulting on our debt is a very different thing. And Ben Carson clearly does not know the difference. And I will add 
that will make no difference to his supporters. None whatsoever. 